Hey everybody, welcome to the Meeple Mentor YouTube channel. I'm Jared, and today we're doing an unboxing video. This is a uh, Mondo Games game called Unmatched, and it has several, uh, well, it has a lot of expansions and a lot of different base games and whatnot. This is a, one of those base games that came out last year, uh, themed around Jurassic Park. Um, and I believe this is a two player only type game. Um, there are cards, there's miniatures. Uh, I haven't played any of the Unmatched series, so I'm very excited to kind of take a look at this one. Um, if you, you know, stuck around the channel, you'd probably notice I also wear like a lot of Jurassic Park shirts uh, on occasion. Um, it's, a, it's just one of my favorite movies, so I had to get this. Um, so it says here it's a 20 minute game, 14, ages 14 and up. Um, on the back, it says, in battle, there are no equals, anyone, anywhere. Unmatched is a fast paced game of tactical combat between unlikely opponents. Choose your hero and use their unique deck and abilities to win the day. Mix up heroes and maps from other Jurassic Park unmatched sets and let chaos reign. Um, so I think any expansion, like whether it's like Marvel or anything, can also be kind of combined. So hence the, the crazy m matchings and pairings. So it's got, you know, some really nice artwork out here. So let's just uh, carefully open this up see what's inside and what it looks like. All right. Good quality box here. We've got the little rule book here on top. It's actually pretty thick considering, you know, a small box game, two players and whatnot. Uh, a lot of color, so that's good. Okay, good. Got some examples in here. Team play. So that's cool. Uh, then I'm seeing we've got this, uh, was it punch out of cardboard tokens? Looks like we'll be building or assembling a health dial for Muldoon. Um, so he gets, according to this, eight traps and very cool. Muldoon, of course, is the, um, the raptor expert in Jurassic Park, the original. Uh, and then we've got to assemble some raptor health dials. Um, so that's pretty fun. Very cool. Uh, right below that, I see a little game map board here. So let's see what it looks like. Well, all right. So the back of it, which is probably not used, is still really nice looking. It's got the Raptor paddock uh, indicated here, plus, you know, just a little uh, top topographical map uh, of the island. But this is the Raptor paddock, apparently. So we've got different spaces here, uh, varying connections. We've got arrows, maybe the one way entry points here um, and then like different colors indicating different types of terrain that you're in. So I'm sure all that really comes into play. So that's the map. As you can see, it's not like too big, but it's good for two players. Here's all the little plastic bits that uh, help you assemble those dials. So I'll get to doing that uh, at a later time. Here we've got some discs, plastic discs, so you can see. Uh, these look like Jurassic Park workers, um, you know, the guys that brought in the raptor in the beginning of the movie, those type of workers, hard hat workers. Uh, I see some miniatures, so I, I do want to take a look at this. Um, this is probably Muldoon. You can kind of see his miniature there. He's got a shotgun. Um, it's got an orange base that does clip on. So if you wanted to paint this, you could, and then put the, the clip on it, uh, the, the base rather. Uh, we've got some raptor miniatures, also removable bases. Okay. And here's another one, different sculpt. This one's kind of attacking forward there with his claws. Um, and then there's a third one. This one is making a, a leap. So he's really only attached there at the bottom with his tail. Um, but that's cool, like he's jumping straight up at you in the air or maybe from above. All right. Um, and then we've got two decks of cards and there's nothing under the box or under the insert. So let's look at these cards. Got a orange deck and a green deck. Let's see if I can carefully open this. All right. 
Ta-da. All right, so we've got a little reference card for your turn and Robert Muldoon. We've got Muldoon's traps, a little reference card, and I'm guessing this is probably all of his traps. So these are, uh, you know, cer certainly looks like shots after the Raptors. You've got Muldoon represented. You've got some of the, the workers represented and uh, different special abilities shown at the bottom. I don't know what these numbers are. Maybe that's like order of initiative if played against another player's card or something. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so that's that's what these cards look like. Very nice quality. It's got, it's got the engine logo on it. And this looks like what the Raptors do and how these guys move. Okay. Take that. So, of course, on your turn and the Raptors stuff. So again, looks like one person's going to be Robert Muldoon and one person's the Raptors. So it certainly goes along with the theme here, engine versus Raptors. Okay, so here's your Raptor deck. Uh, different attacks. We've got the uh, uh, electricity. You've got the purple with the like a shield block type of thing. We've got... Um, any actions hmm interesting coordinated attack pattern choose one of your raptors you may place each of your other raptors in any space in the chosen raptors zone so yeah different attack values in here and different abilities cancel abilities that's cool but otherwise that's that's the deck you're working with so with that your health dials muldoon's health dials and his traps got your decks that's all you need to play, uh, unmatched. And this is the Jurassic Park version. So I'm, I'm really excited to uh, get this to the table and play it two player. Um, you know, I just gotta go through this rule book, <laughs> but I'm excited. Um, if you guys have played it already, because again, it came out last year, let me know what your opinion is of the game. I'm curious, or if there's any uh, quick tips you can give me for my first play or who you, uh, which faction you would suggest that I try out first. Um, but yeah, thanks for tuning into this unboxing video and stick around the channel to check out other stuff. We do a lot of tutorials on the channel. Uh, obviously we do unboxings. We've got a podcast, me and my buddy Jay, we talk about top 10 board games um, in various types of categories and stuff. Um, and we also do interviews with various game designers and publishers, so you can check those out. Um, and every other Friday, I release a board gaming news video called What's New in Board Gaming, where I try to just summarize uh, and collect all the important information that uh, or news that has come out in the past two weeks uh, for that video. So you kind of stay in touch with what's going on both in the industry and on Kickstarter or uh, new announced games. It's, it's pretty cool. So check that out. Um, but I've been Jared. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.